Before we start today's video, check out our merch shop, linked in the description down below. Use code AHSOKA in all caps to get 7 bucks off your order. May the force be with you, and enjoy the vid. Hello there. This is where the fun begins. What's up guys, unofficial Star Wars here. Hope you're all doing well, and in this video we have some big Mandalorian Season 4 rumored around news here. We're going to go ahead and hop right on into it. In this video we are going to be taking a read from StarWarsNewsNet.com. I'll have their article linked in the description down below for you guys to check out there as well. We also have our merch shop up live and running. You guys might find some cool designs on that site you might like. Go give it a look in the description down below. So the recent news about the Mandalorian in season four now as i had mentioned this is simply a rumor so do please take it with a grain of salt but i will also mention that this is not the first time that we've heard of something like this about for the mandalorian season four possibly potentially being actually reworked as a movie instead of being released on disney plus as a show format now alongside with this overall report it's also saying that this could be something that would actually release before daisy release a star wars film now her star wars film is said to be going ahead and releasing uh not not releasing but filming and going into its overall production next year in 2024 in the spring there and from there the Rey Skywalker spinoff movie is something that's looking to be released in 2025 or maybe even 2026 and so the last that we heard about the Mandalorian season 4 or maybe being reworked into a movie the Mandalorian movie I guess is what we'll call it is that that is going to be releasing in 2025 early 2025 probably as it's looking to be filming over the course of the next year 2024 so in a surprising turn of events the rumor mill is suggesting that the fourth season of The Mandalorian might turn around and be the next Star Wars movie instead of the one starring Daisy Ridley as Rey in her return. As their article reads, according to Jeff Snyder on the Hot Mike podcast, that might be what's happening. He claims that the odds are in its favor, actually, that a movie of The Mandalorian is actually on its way in place of the fourth season. And not to confuse you with the Dave Filoni Mando vs. Cultimation movie that was announced at the beginning of this year, that's a separate project, actually. Claiming that this new development may be influenced by this disruption caused by the writers and actor strikes earlier this year. In addition to that, he also had stated that this would come out ahead of Daisy Ridley's new Star Wars movie, starring her back as Rey Skywalker. The original plan, as we all know, was for the next installment on the Din Djarin's led story on the Disney Plus streaming service was supposed to be in a season format, or as a TV, television, you know, kind of format, as a season four. As Jon Favreau had said earlier this year, that the scripts were actually all done. And I do believe that to actually debunk everything that we're discussing here, quite honestly, but but we'll recap back to that in just a moment. Snyder says that the strikes may have changed some things since then, though. Stunt double Brendan Wayne posted last month that season four of Mando is getting ramped up. Notice he didn't say something vaguer, like just The Mandalorian. I think that's also partial evidence that they're working on The Mandalorian season four as to be released on Disney+. Plus. He would have said, like, a Mandalorian project or something more vague into those regards. It's all the more evidence that they're continuing it as a television show for Disney+. Plus. But as I had mentioned, we'll recap back to that in just a moment. It's also makes you wonder of exactly what's becoming of Dave Filoni's Star Wars movie, which was announced at the beginning of this year at Star Wars Celebration, as I had mentioned, which was also supposed to wrap up its event of the Mandalverse overall, in an epic finale for The Mandalorian, The Book of Boba Fett, and Ahsoka, the overall Mandalverse. But mind you, that doesn't necessarily mean that the, that would be the conclusion of The Mandalverse, and that they still both, Jon Favreau and Dave Filoni, have both stated that they would love The Mandalorian universe to continue on even after that movie. Now, anyway, would this new movie replace his one or simply predecess it as therefore being separate projects as I had mentioned I think that's exactly what the case would be theoretically there's no reason that we couldn't get a standalone Mandalorian film before getting this big finale film if for anything it might be a good thing but it would also threaten to rob Filoni's film of some of its grandeur if there's already going to be another film releasing that features those same characters in sense of kind of in a way stealing some of the things that he would want to put in his big cultivation movie earlier this week we also shot down rumors on social media that Daisy Ridley's movie would begin shooting in April, though there's no direct correlation between that and the Mandalorian shooting schedule. The Charmin Obid Chinoy directed film could still come out in May of 2026, or maybe, fingers crossed, 2025, as we've been assuming, as the Mandalorian season 4 should be ready to come out in 2025 anyway, whether or not that's going to be a fourth season on Disney+, Plus, or if it's going to be a movie. The rumor does raise more questions than answers, though, but it's certainly possible that the Mandalorian season 
season four could turn into a movie, especially if Jon Favreau already knows the general story. It would be interesting to see how this would actually pan out. Really, I think and believe all in all this new rumor of that The Mandalorian season four isn't going to be released on Disney Plus and that, oh, they're kind of shifting it away from being a television show to be released on Disney Plus and much rather are reworking the overall script and everything of that nature to be reworked into a movie just doesn't seem right. It just doesn't really line up with anything. Jon Favreau mentioned before the Hollywood strikes earlier this year that the script of The Mandalorian season four is done. It's complete and that it's season four of The Mandalorian, not something vaguer like a Mandalorian movie or a project in that sense. And also basing off of their filming schedule post of the Hollywood strikes before those ever became a thing even, they were saying that they were shooting or looking to be shooting and filming The Mandalorian season four in October of this year. But since then has been pushed back to January of next year, 2024th. So we're about a month away from them actually beginning and ramping up for filming a production uh, of The Mandalorian season four. We would have heard something sooner, I think overall. So as I had mentioned at the beginning of this video, it's simply a rumor. Take it as that, take it with a grain of salt. This just doesn't seem to be very likely whatsoever to be honest with you guys. And then also into this whole idea of that, oh, it's something that's going to be released before the Daisy Ridley, Ray Skywalker spinoff film and her return to the Star Wars franchise as well, just isn't very prominent as well into those regards of what these rumors and overall report is suggesting for the Mandalorian's future. I believe even at that, that it's something that they would have probably announced or confirmed by now or have announced at Star Wars Celebration or revealed at Star Wars Celebration, and I think that we would have heard of this a lot sooner. I want to close you guys out with this. Someone actually took to comment on their article here, reading that my initial thought is that season three of Mando has not been well received and that they're retooling the season four scripts as a result, which that they just aren't. It just doesn't seem very likely, as I had mentioned. Possibly, hopefully, chopping out a lot of the non-Mando stuff to focus back on the titular character, which would probably give them 90 minutes of runtime close to a movie. Maybe the format change is hopes to give a boost, but do viewers really care if it's a movie or if it's a TV show? Not really, but both do have their advantages. But what I'm most interested in is getting compelling stories and characters at the end of the day. It's really about if they're able to write a compelling story, something that the fans will appreciate, I think, and I do really believe in that. So, only time will really tell for what they do have in store for The Mandalorian Season 4. I think I'm very hopeful for that, and uh, into the regards of what we especially saw with The Mandalorian Season 3 finale, giving us that quote-unquote soft reboot of saying, hey, the characters of Bo-Katan and all of her Mandalorians, the Night Owls, and all the characters under the, the armor, and all of her, you know, Mandalorian coverts, all those other side characters are kind of like done. They're sliced from the show, they kind of got their happy ending and their conclusion for the time being. That's not to say that we won't see them in the future, but we won't really be dealing with them as quote-unquote main characters in the future of the Mandalorian uh, show. And that the Mandalorian story is back to just, well, the Mandalorian, Din Djarin, and Grogu. This here all being said, guys, let me know all of your thoughts and opinions in the comment section down below. I would love to hear what you guys are all thinking. Remember, take this as a grain of salt. I just don't think that this is very likely that the Mandalorian season four is being reworked into a movie. I think we would have heard or gotten wind of this by now, especially as they're about to begin production and filming just next month. Let me know what you guys are all thinking in the comments down below. Thanks so much for watching today's video. Of course, this has been Unofficial Star Wars. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Have a great one. May the Force be with you as always. Peace out.